a controversial topic brought back around in southern Utah. The term Redman is a term not recognized within Native American communities as paying respect to the history and legacy of this nation's first people, but rather a slang term that has been used for over 200 years to attribute racial defamation to Native people. Paiute leaders say calling the Cedar High School mascot the Redman dishonors Native Americans. The term red skin or red man came from two places. One, our skin color and the cruel torture of skinning Native Americans in the 1800s for bounties. Autumn Gillard says at the time when Cedar High School adopted the Redmen, Paiutes living in Iron County were at a low in their tribal history. Paiute Indian tribal members were faced with starvation, low income, epidemic of disease, discrimination, segregation, and forced sterilization of our women. But some community members, like Cedar High School alumni, are fighting to bring back the Redmen. It's not about a racial slur or any other thing. It is a badge of honor that they wear. Longtime residents take pride in the name. Redmen is an honorable and cultural rich Native American name that should be respected, not erased. The name keeps our community tied to Native American heritage and motivates our youth and community to learn and take pride in our Native American heritage. Many Native American residents themselves expressing their support for the Redmen. I understand what the tribe is saying, but they do not speak for every single Native American. My children, and many others found that name prideful. Jenna Bree, Fox 13 News, Utah. Now, within the past 30 minutes, the school board decided they are going to draft a proposal to put the Redmen versus Red up for a public vote no later than the November election.